All right, y'all, I am back. As I said last video, I'm recording today. Another one, yeah. So I'll be uploading this um, in the next day, okay? So, today I'm my, well, I am in station one, in station 201, okay? So, you know, I'm going to show you something that, you know, we hold, that I hold dear, at least, all right, to me, okay? I'm going to show you our trophies. Now, this, now I have to say this because right off the bat, trophies for a fire, for fire department? What the hell? Okay, most of it comes from what were called musters. In other words, where, you know, it was pretty much a get-together with other departments. Okay? However, get this. This you're gonna love this. We would actually do firefighter things. Um, the bucket brigade, the battle of the barrel, the fast dress. Um, you know, you know, accuracy. These were all, t you know, of course, of course, you know, you have to have, you know. You know, it has to, you know, you have to ring in the fire engine, all right? I'm going to go ahead and give you a quick glimpse of that. Then, let's go ahead and, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and put a pack on, not my coat, because the hell with my coat right now, all right? I'm not in the mood to wear it. But I'll go ahead and put a pack on, put a mask on. I'm not turning on the pack, just because it gets really annoying, okay? But, here we go. Ready? This is just one trophy case, by the way. One trophy case. Okay. Now, on the bottom, we have a few other things, all right? We have, you know, a second story to this, as you would call it, you know. And here we have some of the older things in our, of, our, of our department, including one melted helmet. A chief's dress dress cap, an old chief's helmet. On the bottom here, we got a standard old firefighter helmet, standard nozzle back then, standard well that's a fog nozzle, that's a smooth bore. That right there, all right, is a uh, ladies auxiliary cap. You know, just another one, another standard old dress hat, an old chief's you know an old white chief's helmet. And in the back there, you'll probably see a firebox and a fire extinguisher. Interesting stuff, I know. You would never see, you know, yes, humor me that. Now, here we have our other one. Okay. And looking back through it, now I'm, now I'm getting sad memories. I'll explain later. But here we go. Here is our other trophy case. Okay. Yeah, trust me, I'm not in the mood for to watch Ghost Adventures either, but you know, I'm not in the mood to turn it off. You know. Okay. Now, I'm gonna show you something real quick. If y'all don't mind. Yeah, actually, let's go ahead and pull this one out. Give me a few seconds. I'm going to have to pop that up like that on my helmet. Okay, give me one second. Now, I have to take my glasses off for this. Glasses are off. Where the... Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Now, chances are you can't get it up now, all right? But this is what you're going to hear if I ever have to go in for you. Okay? Yes, it sounds like crap. You don't deal with it. So, go ahead and get the air pack out. I'm going to go ahead and take this shit off. So that way you can actually hear what I'm saying. I'm leaving that part in the video. Of course I am. Now with editing. Editing is a joke. I've never edited a video in my life. Okay. On with the glasses. Now we get into... Yep. <sighs> the air pack. Now. I'm going to go ahead and pick things up so we can get a real good look. Okay, so, if you ever watch a firefighter show or anything, you'll hear something being called a pass. That is the pass. You want to talk about annoying? Every, if you don't, if you stand still for 30 seconds, it goes off and it is the worst sound magic. No, not just because of that, because it's a high-pitched scream. It, it, it makes uh, Graham hold, and, yeah, it makes Graham, you know, it makes him sound like he's got a proper set of balls. Okay. Now, let's go over another part about this. Oh, yeah. The gauge only works when I've got air through it, and as you can tell, it actually says empty. Okay, now, right here, that tells me how much, you know, the PSI of this tank. You know, for us, standard PSI is about uh, 4,500, okay? Give or take 4,500 pounds per square inch, of course. Now, it should, but it doesn't all the time link up with my mask and I can tell because hold on move that back there see that little black part right there it's not the heart the heads up display I know imaginative okay but this tells me oxygen you know on this side it says whether we are going in you know if, you know if we are continue these if we are going to continue the attack or if we're going to run away because there's a bad chance of something happening. Yes. <coughs> okay. Now, I'll be down here a lot more often. And I'll be able to show you a little bit more about this station and a little bit about a little bit more about the queen to the king of this department. The pride of our fleet, the queen of everything we have. Two hundred two, the Terminator. Okay. Now, for those who don't know the name, you know, we got her the first. You know, we got her the same year as the first Terminator movie came out, and it's just stuck. So, you know, she is a custom built for us. But that's all I'm gonna tell you. I'll get into more depth when I have when I have to make a video about her to satisfy your weird needs. Okay. See y'all later, and have a nice day.